Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Look here, I uh, 
Welcome back to another episode of uh, White Line Fever. And uh, once again, due to COVID regulations, we've had to go uh, digital with today's post-match interviews. Uh, now I have Dan and Sean lined up here from uh, Locomotive Bay Quarter. Uh, nine win, uh, nine nil win over uh, Diamonds uh, this week. Um, after a good uh, start in the first half, um, a bit of a disappointing uh, second half with the uh, from the other team, really, with um, numbers wise, um, kind of felt we were taking advantage of them a bit. I think there. Um, I assume you'll um, agree with me there, Dan. Um, but I say the lads kind of really hammered at home. Um, you know, we had the strong foundation starting off, and um, you know, we won the game in the end. Um, so I hand you over to Dan and Sean. Um, I'm sure you have some questions for Sean there, Dan. Uh, but over to you guys. Thank you, Andy. So, what do you say about last week's game? Um, boring, sloppy. Uh, where's the petrol? Um, Would I drive back to Fraser Park ever again in my life? No, probably not. Anyway, lads, thank you for the game of football. Um, the change rooms are nice. Could have done with a cafe open. I mean, I'm going to spend that money on a vending machine. Simple, simple things. Would have been a nice feature. Um, pitch is good. Referee was good. Um, but yeah, the finishing lads uh, against eight men. Hmm. Poor, really. Have I seen a worse game of football in my life? No. The answer is no. Thanks for wasting my Sunday. Um, we'll see you again this week, eh? Back to the studio. Clean sheets, all that matters. Thanks, Dan. Uh, thanks, Sean. Uh, hopefully we can come uh, come away with a win uh, this weekend uh, against Tuscan and uh, win the league. It should be a really good match. Uh, it's a really good uh, down the pub afterwards if we win. Say quite a few uh, beers will be going around. Uh, it's good luck again. good luck again for this week, guys. Back to the studio. So here with the manager for Locomotive Beer Quarter. Uh, James Horecker, uh, nice comfortable uh, 9 no one for you guys today. Uh, uh, so second half, um, kind of quite easy for you guys uh, with the other team only down to eight players uh, due to um, a lot of their players not showing up. Um, so I think it was, and they just managed to scrape by with uh, 11 players in the uh, first half. But say so that second half, they really dropped down uh, in numbers wise. Uh, just give us your thoughts on the game there. Oh, what's that? We're on. We're live. Thanks for that, Andy. Thanks for the intro. Nice to be here. I am looking forward to tomorrow's game against Tuscan. And oh yeah, T Tommy ran a great warm up. Thanks, Andy. Yeah, thanks for that, Jimmy. I say uh, this week's game should be really interesting uh, against Tuscan. Uh, hopefully, we can win and uh, win that league. It'd be really good. I say uh, good luck to our boys over the uh, ESKA. I uh, hope they pull out another win. Uh, should be really good for them. Back to the studio. <laughs> 